Oh my god, look at my hair. It's like a lion's mane. I swear I could be that lion at the beginning of all those films. Yep, that should definitely be the intro to all my YouTube videos. Hi guys, it's Ryan, and I'm here to talk to you about how I don't know what I want to do with my life. Yay! Many of you may say, Ryan, aren't you 20-something? Shouldn't you know what you want to do with your life? First off, I'm 20, okay? 2-0. Not 20-something, 20. Although I am turning 21 in like a month. But that that's not the point. The point is, is that I am not that old. Yes, my childhood might have been spent listening to the Backstreet Boys, NSYNC, Spice Girls, and playing with Pogs. But before you say, what are those, or who are they, and make me feel older than I already am, let me just say that 21 is the new 19, okay? If Taylor Swift can embrace being 22, then I can, Im I can surely embrace being 21. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Taylor Swift! I'm only 21! Anyway, I'm getting off topic, as I always do. The main point of this video is to discuss the fact that I used to know what I wanted to do with my life, but now that I've hit my 20s, I have no idea anymore. My mom always tells a story of when I was seven years old and I came home one day and told her, mom, I want to do two things in life. One, I wanted to be an elementary school teacher. And the second was that I wanted to be on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. I guess I could still go on the show, although I don't even know who's the host anymore. Oh, I hope it's some like washed up celebrity now, like like Lindsay Lohan or, or Paris Hilton. Oh my god. <laughs> On second thought, I'll pass. When I turned 16 years old, I wanted to pursue an acting career. I decided that I would act in my own comedy skits and put them all up on YouTube. If you haven't seen any of my old videos, warning, they're completely awful, there's poor acting, and they're just made for lols. They were just made for the lols! But if you want to check them out, I'm sure they're suggested on here or here or you could just browse my videos on my main channel i'm sure you'll find them at the bottom of the list some say my acting was a hybrid between ron weasley and napoleon dynamite i ended up making this video of my exaggerated life as a ginger and for some reason ended up getting like thousands of views on youtube i don't know why it got so many views when the video was complete crap but I guess people enjoyed it for its flaws. Not to mention that it was a lot of fun making the video with a bunch of my friends and classmates from back home. When I started getting thousands of views, YouTube contacted me to become a partner with them and start making videos on a regular basis. I was only 16 at the time, and the fact that one of my videos got over 20,000 views scared me. I'm from a town with a population of 6,000, so the fact that I had 20,000 views on my video frightened the heck out of me. Not to mention that my parents wanted me to go to university, as opposed to making videos for YouTube. Damn parents! Just kidding. Hi mom and dad, don't ground me, thanks, bye. From the ages of 17 until now, I've spent my years studying film and media at university. Although I love the university life, I still feel like it hasn't really helped me choose like a career path. If anything, it's opened up a larger variety of things I could possibly do with my life. And now that I'm graduating next year, I feel like I have to know exactly where I want to be going in life. All I know is, is that I love making videos and I love meeting new people. Perhaps I'm just having one of those 20-something crises and just being over dramatic about life. My life, I'm so dramatic. <laughs> However, recently I came across a YouTube video by Briarly Bishop, who you should check out here, by the way, just because she's such a sweetheart and she's one of my favorite YouTubers. Basically, she was having the same 20-something crisis as me and I could sympathize with her. So Briarly, you're not alone, girl. No matter of the fact is that I don't think I could commit to a 9-to-5 job. I want to see more of what the world has to offer. I want to meet new people, travel to more places, and go on epic adventures. The fact that I don't have a plan for what I want to do or where I want to live in the next five years is scary. But I feel like this is normal for someone my age. Do you know what you want to do with your life? Are you like me and a little bit lost and just don't know what you want to do? Or are you one of those non-mainstream people that know what they want to do with their life? And by that I mean hipsters who are like, Yeah Ryan, I've known what I've wanted to do for my whole life since I was born. Gosh. As they sit in their parents' basement. The majority of you are probably younger than me, and so I don't know if any of you can relate to my crisis at the moment. But if you can relate and sympathize with my current situation, then please do leave a comment below. Am I the only one that feels this way? Let me know so that I feel that I'm not alone in this world of thousands of jobs and not knowing which one to take. On a happier note, I've decided to make YouTube videos on a regular basis, so you will be seeing more of this. Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy. And this. <laughs> Shut up, Taylor Swift! Shit, that's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>
<laughs> so if you do like seeing me make a fool of myself and enjoy my rants such as this, then please give my video a thumbs up. It really helps out and supports me. And please do subscribe to my channel as I will be posting more videos on a weekly basis. I also answer questions on Twitter, so if you have a question or just want to talk, tweet me up. My Twitter is at Ryan Thomas Wood, and I'll leave a link down below. Again, if you guys could leave comments and or video responses down below, that would be amazing. I will go through all the comments, so please feel free to say anything and anything you want. Anyways, on that note, I'll see you guys all next week. Bye!